This is about about Toby Charlie. Yeah, Toby Charlie. No, usually everybody celebrates or move according to your tradition. What you worship, that is what you believe in. We believe in our grandfather, our great grandfather, which is Toby Charlie, because he's a very mysterious person. He did so many things. He used to manifest at different, different places. With, when he manifests here, he has a work to do over there. When he finishes that one, he go to another town. When, I should say that, when he sees that there is decline in women morality, he used to appear as a master to change the system. Because, you know, we are in the world mess up with so many bad things. So our grandmaster is a person when he see that there is a fall in religion or fall in tradition or spiritualism. Spiritualism he used to take a form. When he take a form, he used to uplift the people's moral, spiritual morality. So this is what he did. He did so many things. So a person who do so many things, you have to appreciate that person. Mm. So he is our father. So if you know the great things what your father has done, you have to praise it. You have to let it shine. You don't have to hide it under the under a tree or something. That is what we are trying to propagate our grandfather, our grandmaster, who is so This is it's all about. We learned that in the olden days lead our people from their yeah, estate from, from places to places. The last place was Mochi. Be, because being a mystic man, he used to come out survey and see how things used to go. Because of that strong energy, he can do so many things and manifest at different, different places. But because of our colonial master dogma, dogmatism, we have forgotten the reality of our people. So we, they, they taught us to believe what they brought is the best. Ours, we should leave it. So I was a Christian when I was going on. Oh, you're a Christian? Yeah, I was a Christian. Wow. Yeah. When I was going on, going, growing, 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 reached a time. And then I was in Liberia when the things started. So I have to come down. Come down. They say, these are the things coming from our ancestors. So I have to follow it, look for it. I'm, I was searching for it, searching for it. And I was searching for it. I came to know that this is the value. And I know the value of what spirituality is. Through the nation, you see so many things. That we have seen that people are trying to blackmail our forefathers. That means that you have to leave your own and follow theirs. When you follow them, you reach a time, you see that you are suffering because you neglect your, your own identity, taking different identity. You see, that is the reason why we are trying to. Let those are coming after us to know the reality, to, to know the facts. This is not a Satan worship or fetish worship. There is nothing like fetish. They made the white, our so called people, they made the word fetish. God created everything and He's blessed it and it's good. You should use it. If you are a white man, you have your approach of worshiping God. We, the blacks, too, we too, we have our, our way of worshiping God. Why should you come and tell us that what our forefathers are doing is bad? So that thing has been going on for so many times. So when you enter my, my family now, they are all Christians. I'm the only person who said that I have to follow my tradition. Wow. Yeah. Not that I wish. The situation forced me to know the truth, the facts. That makes me today, I'm here. Wow. Mm. 
So, uh, Togbo Charlie was actually a human being. Togbo Charlie was a human being. He lived on he this live, life. He lived. He lived. As a human being. being, yeah. As a human being. As a human being. So, yeah, that is. Charlie was, is, and will continue to be a human being. Was, is, is and continues. Because the interpretation of the name Charlie, he who was, is, and shall always be. According to Pharaoh Ramses II, when you read the back page of Secret Mentions of the Pharaoh by Cornelius Theta, you will see it there. Who was Charlie? Charlie was, is, and still shall be. So that's why you can find him in North Carolina. You can find him in any part of the world. Go on. <laughs> <laughs> that, that, that's the question I was going to ask because in, in our times we are uh, made to believe that we should not worship a fellow human being so if he was a human being I mean that he just corrected as is still a human being why do we offer a bull to a human being you know because he has grown up in, in spirit he attained a a, a, sta a stage which is, we may call it a Christ stage because look at the one person can manifest here, manifest there, manifest there. When he manifests here, he, he has different ways, different names, but he's still Charlie. You see? That person is a mystic man. Why shouldn't you watch, watch that person? So, if I'm understanding what you're saying, it's just like the way the Hindus have their Buddhas and Krishnas and stuff like that. Yeah. That they were once human beings walking. Yeah. No, the Buddhists. I'm, I'm asking. The Buddhists. Their worship is just like a weed in Aries. They worship deity. And they believe that the deity form of worship is the highest form of worship. We, the Aries, we, we worship the deities. Because the spirit or the spirit, they are move, hovering, around in the spirit, uh, hovering around in the air. You have to give them a seat so that they can sit and talk to you. That, that make it a deity, you see. So we, our people, believe in deity worship because it is a higher form of worship. So what you're saying is that he has now become a spirit being. Yeah. That is moving all over. All over. Place. It's an energy. It's an energy. Yeah. So is he the only person that can be like this or every other human being can be? No, if you develop spiritually like him, you be like him. Wow. Yeah. If you as an individual develop yeah. spiritually, yeah. you can move to the dimension where you'll be revered just as uh, Tobe is being yeah. revered. Yeah. Because when you go to Agave side, you have the brothers over there. According to the according to them, when he's farming here, you he make it that the rain will, will it will rain at his portion. All this it won't rain. It was only rain at this portion. Yeah, that is the olden times. No, because now science is doing the technology where it can rain at certain places. They can literally manipulate the rain. You mean thousands of thousands of years ago, Tobi Charlie was already doing this. Doing those things. It is a, a science that uh, that is that time. Our people are very intelligent. They move spiritual. They use spirit more than physical. Yeah, you know, most of the things they used to write or talk is some of them is not physical. It's a spiritual thing because he's a spiritual being. He has the power to talk to talk to the tree to move. So if you develop, you too can have that power to talk to the spirit. Wow. Yeah. It is something like something used to. Working in the how do you call it? Your mind, you see. So if you have 
you are sound in mind, you, you are developed in, in, spiritually in mind, you can talk to the tree in mind, to, you can command the tree in mind to move. But hearing you say this, this is literally what the New Testament promises, that if, if you have faith as the size of a master seed, you can move mountains, you can do this, you can do this. We call it faith, but we, it's not faith. You will say a word and things will happen. It's not just believing. No, just not believing. Practical, you say that. You see the thing, not that you just form this, or you follow this thing and believe it, no. You touch it, you feel it. That is why we say that uh, we worship deities. Talk to the deities, and the deities, the deities will, will respond. When I was coming, I had um, a conversation that says that Toby Charlie was a twin and had a young uh, a brother behind them, and the brother became the warlock, the warrior, and um, the twin of Toby Charlie is Confanoche. Yeah. Is that true? Because a lot of people say it's not true. It's true. If you don't, if they don't have twin, you don't have the twin, the one born after the twin. Because they had a twin, that's why they have the one born after, born after the twin. Yeah. So, Konfanochi, who was dominant in the Ashanti region, was actually from. He's from our our Evela. He was born around here. He was from our Evela. Because he's, he's very high in spiritual, they used to consult him. So, you, you know, they all live together. He is a mystic man, he too is a mystic man. And they have the brothers, some of them too. They are not grown powerfully like Eche and Achu. You see? And so the names are Che and Achu. Yeah, it is twin. So Achu is Anoche. Yeah. And Che is Tobochali. Yeah. Wow. So that is, it is the fact that it is the twin brother of our Togbi Charlie that is the Kung Fu from Anoche. Wow. So you see, the fact is there. So how long did it take him to develop? Anyway, for so many, many years, we can't tell. Because that man, he grow, 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 even, he can't even die. Wait, 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 he could not die? He could not die. So how did he move? How did he transition like? Yeah, he was, he now he's fed up with this life. He wanted to die. Oh. So he called uh, the crocodile. He sat on the crocodile, entered the sea. He went to the wait, 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 wait. He called a crocodile from the sea. Yeah. A crocodile in the sea. Yeah. Crocodile is, is an energy. He called it, he manifest. He sat on the crocodile, he entered the sea. He roam, 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 roam. He go to, he went to the, how do you call it, Asamaru. I may say that way. Land of the dead. So and he literally transitioned. Yeah. He didn't die like most of us. You die, you no, no, no. get buried and all no, no, that. No, 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 no. So when we reached there, they told him that you don't have to get this job over there. You have to leave your job before coming. So he returned. When he returned, he removed the jaw and leave it here. Add some here. Add something wait, wait. sacred thing. He, 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 he removed the jaw. He removed the jaw together with the, the teeth. That is the shrine or uh, the, the grove we are talking of. At Chama, where you are coming from. The grove is there. Is there? Our people speaking. are trying to destroy all the groves. Even the the, the the edifice, that is the roof. Uh, the, his room over there, where you can find the, the jaw, they are trying to destroy that room too. Why? No, because of greediness. They don't want any, because we don't develop, we don't want any development to come to our 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 area, the particular chairman. If they know the value of that, I don't think they have to be doing those things. Wow. This is what is paining us. Those who believe it. That is our heritage. That is our history. We will tell our children. But they are trying to spoil, our, uh, spoil that heritage because of mere enviness. You see? No. I even said it today that he just silent over there. He's not talking. Those who are destroying, trying to destroy his sacred group, he just leave them like that. Even if you, you are ready, he can take you over there to see it for yourself. 
because we believe in seeing. Seeing. So when when we go, we we'll see the jaw of. Yeah, you see. Even though we cover it, cover it, but there is a portion. When you look inside that portion, you see that there is a jaw with it. With it. Yeah. So that great person did so many things. Wait. How can we try to show that person? But, but wait. How did he get the jaw out? That is that is <laughs> That is that is that is a mystic. That is a mystic. But here you are talking about the master. Wow. The master who can command things to happen. So, you know, when you have your third eye open, you will see him. You will see him. You will see him in the sea. Sitting on the, he saw, he saw that is a purple guy. He still existing. But if you say existing, if you have a third eye, you will see it. So you see him. Oh yeah. Are you sure? Oh yes, of course. <laughs> I used to hear from them because I did in clear audience. You hear them. So if one says that okay, I want my third eye to open so that I can also see and hear, what, <laughs> what is a process? <laughs> a long process. <laughs> wow. Yeah. So this talk which Ali we are worshiping here, it is not a dead person. It's not a ghost. It's a living being. He just left the body, and the spirit is moving. It's a master he can manipulate. Oh. Yeah. You see, after entering the sea, he didn't come back. For the second time, he didn't come back again. But the spirit is still living. But somebody also asks, okay, if there's the creator, why would you still worship Tobo Chale? Who is the creator? The, the creator of all, <laughs> all things. The one that created that. Who is the creator? I mean, nobody has seen the creator. Uh -huh. Nobody has heard of the creator. Uh -huh. But then we know something created everything. Uh -huh. that then nobody has seen the creator. Yeah. And this is a man making so many things, manifestations, manifesting himself, expanding himself. Why can't you believe that person? So uh, th then I think um, we, we have to understand the word worship well. Because some of us, when we hear worship, it means that you totally go under and totally bow down to the person. But hearing a conversation, I'm beginning to understand that it's a total reverence yeah. that you give to Tobi Charlie for Just all that. Just pay Oh. We don't worship it. It's an uh, uh, energy. Mm. When you invoke that energy, it will come to you. Mm. Yeah. So, so I'm, I'm getting it. Yeah. So if a uh, European come to you and tell you that that thing is bad, whereas you yourself, you feel the presence of that person, feel the presence of that energy, and somebody is telling you that that it is not existing, will you believe in that person or you will not believe it? Per perhaps the reason why they are saying it's bad, because it's killing a lot of people, killing a lot of children. Killing? What I, kill when I came, my father was telling me, mm -hmm. the police came around mm -hmm. saying, They've cut seven heads, seven human heads. They claim. And they they claim, claim has cut seven human heads and buried under somewhere. You are welcome. <laughs> you, are welcome. You, know, you, have, you two, you have come to the, uh, to the, the groove. Yeah. Have you seen a human being head? No, I, I didn't see any human being. Mm. That is the real practice. Somebody somewhere just to blackmail, just to for, spoil your name, mm. just to shun our religion, just to shun our tradition. Mm. You see? You yourself, you witness, you are, you are witness. Did you see, did you kiss somebody over here? No. Every year, this is what we do. The black bull, the black bull. Wow. Who can testify that they have seen it? Or just a, a rumor? You see, they are trying to blindfold us, forcing their religion upon us. We say that is not true. We feel the energy. The energy is there. When you are feeling the energy, somebody is telling you that that energy is not existing. Will you believe that person? But here is the case we see a lot of people become priests and convert to Christianity. So is it possible that one day we will hear that my own who know, Tobe himself has converted and has become a Christian? No, no, that is that because you found the light. No, 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 that is that is that is that is never that is never. What is what is what is what is the light? I'm having the light already. I'm having the light already. I can't leave the light and go to darkness. Because we believe that when you do this, you will pay for it. When you do this, you will pay for it. When you leave and enter that so-called light, 
you can do so many things. You can do bad things. Nothing will hurt you. But we over here, when you do something bad, they will tell you that this is bad. Stop it. If you don't stop it, you will die. And if somebody saying that you can do that, you will die before you go to heaven somewhere for judgment. For us, it's not like that. When you do bad, you pay for it here. Because it is this body that do the bad. You have to pay for it. Oh, be it's still living. Because the body committed a crime and an error, yeah. the body has to pay for you it. You have to pay for it. Not that you, that you, go, you go to so-called heaven. Where is the heaven? So in our ways, mm -hmm. you don't believe that there's a heaven and there's no, a no, hell No, 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 no. No heaven, no hell. No heaven, no hell. No heaven, no hell. To me, no heaven, no hell. It is just an artificial creation made by the white man. Wow. Yeah. It's taught our, our great people their riches. There is no hell, there is no heaven. Because I believe that what I'm seeing is divination. Mm -hmm. And when you go to the Bible, they say those who go to divineness mm -hmm. are sinful, they are sinning. Mm -hmm. That is why even when Saul died and Saul went to the diviner, the, the energy came out and said, why are you disturbing me? And God in the Bible punished Saul for going to the diviner. So why are you saying that there's no hell for sin? Those things is just a lie. Interrupting. But if you are quoting from the Bible, I will ask you, who wrote the Bible? <laughs> the stories of the Bible, where does it come from? Mm. Do you know where Ephesus is? Mm. There is a Paul's letter to the Ephesians. Mm. Who were the Ephesians? Mm. They are texts, Islamic texts. Mm. Up till today, Ephesus is in Istanbul. Wow. You go to Turkey, you will get all the things which have been written in the Bible because why? Saint or Emperor Constantine mm. lived there. And all the jokes that he carried out, the amount of people, the number of people killed by Constantine wow. in the establishment of the Roman Catholicism, they are still there, evidence for you to see. They created the character they call Jesus Christ. Wow. And you know what? The first ship we took our ancestors the way into slavery was named what? Jesus. Christ. Jesus. Why do you name a ship involving itself in such blatant destruction? Jesus. And you want to believe that Jesus? You want to believe that that Jesus died for your sins? Mm. Do you know that Jesus? Does he know you? <laughs> Maybe he knows me in spirit. He knows you in spirit. <laughs> Dr. Charlie does not only know us in spirit, he knows us physically. You call his name. Go to North Carolina and you will see Charlie there. The truth must never leave you. If you read the Bible, even the Old Testament, find out what was the system of writing. That was hieroglyphics. At the time they were writing the Bible, who could have interpreted the words of hieroglyphs? They couldn't. Hmm? You have the Lord Gautama Buddha. You mentioned him. What's the name? What's the meaning of Buddha? Say, respect the snake. So you go into the temples, you see the snake deity. The snakes are all over the place. You go to Benin here. There is a place called Glehwe. Gle is a snake. Kwe is the house. Hmm? The house of the snake. Snake, house of the snake deity. And opposite the house or the temple of the snake deity, you have the cathedral, Roman Catholic cathedral, up till today. You take a ride and go down to, they call it Wida. What's the meaning of Wida? We in French means yes. And da, snake. Yes, snake. Wida. Right? 
Now, if these people who came and told us that there was somebody who used his rod, he hit the rod on the ground and the rod turned into what? Snake. If you have a book which tells you that somebody was deceived by a snake, the snake spoke to her. And that was the first sin committed. And they tell you that you came out of sin. <laughs> so somebody who died, they told us he was crucified on the cross among two thieves. And you believe that one. <laughs> and they told you that he died Friday afternoon. Sunday morning he has resurrected. And they told you that, oh, that was three days. <laughs> That was three days when they buried him. He allegedly got up. And what did he do? He went and organized his people. They went for a party. After that party, he went to heaven to go and sit on the right hand side of God the Father Almighty. Well, how do you believe that one? <laughs> God is a spirit, God is not a physical being. So nobody could sit on God's right hand side. Right? Hmm. So if that is the case, why do you have to believe such a blatant story? Go to Wikipedia and check from Wikipedia. The, what is the Bible? Hmm? The Old Testament Bible was written in hieroglyphics. The New Testament Bible was captured in hieroglyphics. And the New Testament came as a result of the Nicene Creed. Nicaea is in Turkey up till today. It's not going anywhere. Where the land of Nicaea is still in Turkey. So why do you come to believe that one? And Constantine, who killed and killed and killed? King Leopold. He told his missionaries, going to the Congo, don't teach the Africans the knowledge of God, because the Africans already knew God. And these are the people who are messing us up, and we are believing them. Hmm. Why? So Robert Nestor Mali tells you, emancipate yourself from mental slavery. We have been mentally enslaved for far too long. And the first enslavement of black people took place in the Nile Valley. Mm. Hmm? Really? Uh, yes. Why? Because the Pope gave a directive. Why? Because Constantine had died, and the Muslims have taken over the land of Turkey. And Turkey is still Islamic up till today. When Constantine died, you read the Turin Judicial Papyrus and all those idiots parading around saying that they are lawyers and they are justices. They will admit to you that those laws which were made were laws of the black man. So thou must not kill. And America will pray to all the God Almighty to help them kill people. And they tell you in God we trust. With God you trust him. That God we says that don't kill, but kills. And God orders his people, go and kill all of them. Kill all the animals. Don't spare any. And this God is the one we are supposed to worship. So are we saying that in our ways, in our truth, we don't kill? In spirituality, we don't kill. We don't say that we don't kill, and we won't say that we kill. But it is not part of our laws that thou must not kill. Mm. Nobody who came and said ours was bad, he was bringing us the good one, and he is killing. Mm. And his disciples and apostles are killing in his name, and he keeps quiet. Mm. The deities of the black race, if they tell you thou must not kill, and you kill, you will suffer. Mm. You will have the punishment. Mm. They came and they said we were doing troncoshi, mm. hmm, the Vestal Virgins of the Roman Empire. 
claimed that he had had a sexual intercourse with one of the Vestal virgins. Hmm. Then the Romans got angry that the Vestal virgin should not have any sex with anybody. They, they wanted to penalize her so much, and she said she swears by the goddess Vesta that if she ever had sex with any man, they should throw her into the fire. They threw her into the fire, and she was still standing in the fire. Wait, she didn't burn. How can she burn? Does this not sound like the story of um, the book at Nazar and um, what do you call it? Who is that? The, the, the three Hebrew boys. Where is Nebuchadnezzar? Meshach, Shadrach, and Abednego. I agree. Where is he? <laughs> huh? Can you tell us where Nebuchadnezzar operated? <laughs> yeah? I have told you up till today, mm. even the hieroglyphs in which all the things have been written, mm. they are still there. No, people cannot even understand. Mm. Take any hieroglyphic text. Go to the Greek embassy or the Greek cultural center and show it to them whether they can tell you what is written there. So who, who can read the hieroglyphs? Hieroglyphs can be read by the people who captured the information. And who are those people? Those are the tonal language people as discovered and written by Herodotus. The supposed father of uh, European history. And these people who speak this language are? Where you are sitting now, <laughs> that is the language of the ancient of days. <laughs> huh? The wow. language of the ancient of days. Well, what is the language? We were calling, our ancestors were calling that water body the divine snake river. So they said it's Sedan, the divine snake. When they left, they left with that deity, the snake deity. And they created a home for the snake deity. And they called that home what? Da home. Da home. Then the white man said, no. If this one is making these people still respect their snake deity. Mm. So let us change the name. Then they changed it to Benin. Oh. So initially, the whole place was called Daomi. The home. Oh. The house of the snake deity. And they changed it to Benin. To Benin. But we have Benin city in Nigeria, Nigeria. already. Yeah. Why do you create another Benin here? So I, I was honestly always confused by that. I, I always wondered why we have Benin state and Benin country. Like, it never made sense yes, to me. because it is the white man who is uh, creating confusion into our minds. What mm. do we have? We had the Portuguese coming to name our coast. Mm. They named one part of the coast the grain coast, mm. where they got grains. Grains. They named another part of the coast the ivory coast, where they got ivory. ivory. Mm. They named another portion the gold coast. Where they had a gold. Yeah, okay. Then the fourth portion, slave they coast. named the slave coast. Where will they get, what will they get from there? Slaves. Okay, so when you have uh, these uh, African Americans doing their DNA and oh, telling you. Oh, and the DNA keeps sending them other places. <laughs> yes. But the coast that they had as slaves, it never takes them there. No, it don't take you there because that will expose their wickedness. Oh, so they, they, they've thrown everybody off course. They have to. If they don't do that one, what will happen? Because everybody is going to Cape Coast. Yes. You have to go to Cape Coast. Why go to Cape Coast? Because they are telling you that that's where they took people from. Exactly. So they say there is some uh, water body where people bath before they are taken so. away. I actually went there. I went there to do some investigations and I realized that the actual water body that slaves went through it's not even as a mansion so you are seeing it <laughs> you will have to find the physical evidence that they have lied that they continue to lie and they will continue to lie mm. if they don't do that one how come that britain has not got gold mm. but the queen has more gold than ghana which is supposed to be the gold coast mm. what happened was Cape Coast not the former 
capital of Ghana. Of the Gold Coast. Gold Coast, yes. And why did they change it? And they brought it to where? Accra. Accra of Ra. Wait, 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 wait. There, wait, wait. there is the Ark of Ra. If wait. If you brought to the Ark of Ra, it will take you from the Southern River Valley and drop you into Ark of Ra. Accra. Wait, so the original meaning of Accra is it's the Ark of Ra. Wow. That I didn't know, guys. I mean. Today is the day of Amen Ra, mm. the sun god. Mm. And the sun god, who is the sun god? And you go to church and worship. On, on a Sunday. Sun, the day of the sun. Mm. Except those people who said that uh, they are what? Uh, they have the Sabbath on Saturday. Mm. Why? They are Jehovah Witnesses. Seven day, seven day Adventists. Mm. Who were the Seven Day Adventists? Where did they get their information from? They got the information from the judicial papyrus. Brooklyn. Mm. But where does Papyrus go? In Africa. In Africa, along the water bodies mm. of the tropics. Mm. Brooklyn has no Papyrus growing there. So if they have some papyri <laughs> containing information and they use that information to create the, well, the Jehovah Witnesses or Seventh day Adventist Bible. What are you telling yourself? And you go to theological institute to go and learn this foolishness. And you get degree in foolishness. And you come <laughs> back and you say you are professor this or that. You are a theologian. Mm. And you can't even talk to the snake. Mm. I have a picture of his imperial majesty, Emperor Haile Selassie. When, when I was in Addis Ababa, you will see the emperor, when he was alive, moving with two lions. One on his right, one on his left. I have another picture of Ethiopian soldiers when they were attacked. They will send their lions, they call their lions and send them to go to the enemy territory. Wow. And they will come there and devour you protecting the land of Ethiopia. It was you that made me even know that the name Selassie brought my mind to the name Selassie. Selassie. What is the meaning of Selassie? There is Selassie around here. Where is it? <laughs> there is a Selassie here. That is sacred name. So they tell you, man, know thyself. Know thyself. Who were you at the beginning of time? Let nobody come and tell you Jesus was born on some day, 25th of December. Then they go and worship on the 25th of December. And when you come to pay obeisance to the creator of the universe, then they say, now you are involved in witchcraft or... Yeah. But what is witchcraft? It's a craft. You want to acquire that craft? <laughs> that you can do astral projection, you can move from one phase of yourself into another. I had a boss some time ago. The daughter is the only one who is not a Christian. And the, the brothers, the sisters, were at local heads with her. But their father, when he was alive, you will come and you will see him standing here in his uniform. But the body, he is only leaving the body there. He is gone. Mm. He will go round, round, round and come.